What's up guys, the Panthers here and welcome to my third and final top 100 monthly and weekly rewards. I don't know when you're seeing this, maybe Saturday, maybe Sunday, depending on how many likes the other videos got today. We are on Stop Hitmarker's account. If you remember for the last monthly rewards, he got the most insane rewards I think I've ever seen. An incredible legend, an incredible set of reds. His team of the week pack was sick. He just got, he just lucked out. So we'll see how that translates into today's uh, pack opening. Of course, if you want to check out Stop Hitmarker, links to his socials will be in the description below. I appreciate Stop Hitmarker, Medibob, and Epsilon Joey for all the hard work that they put in over the last month to allow me to bring this content to you guys. So if we could get a like on the video for their hard work as well, it would be much appreciated. Now, like with Medibob and with uh, Epsilon Joey, I'm going to run you through the team. Look, he's already got that 96 Messi there waiting for it out of reds. Um, this is an interesting team. I'm sure he doesn't use much of this bench. Nothing on Thiago. 42 on Casemiro. Good. Not a lot of games on Hazard. 93 games on that 91 Hazard. 109 only on Martial. Uh, a few bronzes there. He's got Dybala, the 87, with a decent return. As a sub, you, yeah, not bad at all. Doesn't use Perisic. A very nice return on Arturo Vidal. Mane with a lot of games, but not a good return. People are very, very hit and miss with this Mane. His card stats suggest he should be one of the best in the game, and he's just not. Not for a lot, anyway. Dembele also with only the 89 games and 10 goals. Paul Pog with a severe amount of games, a nice amount of goals and assists, and no games yet used on Dries Mertens. Antoine Griezmann with a great return. Patrick Vieira, a brand new acquisition to the club. 77 games on that red Nangolan, which he got in the last monthly rewards. And what a car that is. Nangolan's team of the season is going to be insane. Kevin De Bruyne's red card, only the four games. And what a card. Let's see if we can get the 91 De Bruyne this time around. N'Golo Kante with 70 games. What a card that is. Alexandro, 290. A new acquisition of Rio Ferdinand with 10 games. Nearly 1,000 now on Laurent Blanc and Carl Walker there with nearly 1,600 games. Uh, I believe this uh, Laurent Blanc is untradeable, and yes, it is indeed. Uh, Rio Ferdinand is tradable, and of course, uh, Patrick Vieira, brand new acquisition as well. So that is the team that Stop Hitmarker used to drag himself into the top 100. And I say drag himself into because he literally finished 50th for the month. 50th for... 50th for the month, and literally, oh wait, Elite one didn't, wait, hold on, two, I thought he finished, I thought he finished 100th in the week, so we have got top 100 monthly, I thought stop hit marker, hit bang on 100th for the week. Interesting. 36 wins, which was top 100 for some. Somebody else must have got in there on skill points. Previous. Where did he finish monthly? That's interesting to me. I legitimately thought he had finished um, 100th. Let's go last week. So he finished Elite 1 last week and Elite 1 this week with 36 wins. That's brutal as it is. Last month, um, 13th with 191 wins, and this month, uh, current month, 50th with 145 wins. Why did I think that he finished 100th in the week? Current weekly, who finished one? Oh, it's Henri 14 Legend, because it's, it's another viewer of mine that I talk to on stream a lot. Finished 100th for the week and 99th for the month. He scraped in. Stop Hitmarker did not scrape in. Stop Hitmarker didn't even get in top 100 for the week. 30, uh, 36 wins wasn't enough for him. So he missed out, I guess, on... Um, missed out on... Missed out on top 100 via skill points. But we do have the top 100 champions pack. So two 100k packs. No walkout to start with. Can we get an inform? No, but that's a big flare. That's an 87 flare, that is. That is uh, going to be... Han Danovic indeed was an 87 player. Now, not the greatest pop card to pull, but he obviously will be very nice for squad builder challenges through team of the season. Murtasaka, wow, you just you never see Murtasaka, do you? None of the big cards again. No Renato Sanchez, no Carl Walker, no Hector Bellerin. 
We'll send everything to the tray pole. I'll let him do what he uh, what he needs to do with his uh, 100k pack players. Next 100k pack, no walkout again. Can we get an inform? Wow. Not only no inform, it's going to be Nolito. One of the worst 83s in the game. No question about it. Schneider, Juan Fran. Juan Fran's all right, I suppose. Um, but once again, none of the elite low tier players. That makes sense. Uh, no Carl Walker, no Bellerin, no Luke Shaw, um, no Smalling, no Eric Bailly. Like, that was pretty trash. So we've now got two premium Team of the Week packs. Let's hope for two Emre Chans. Emre Chan, I think, and Costa are the two most expensive. Let's hope for one walkout and one or two Emre Chans. Let's see what we get in the first one. No walkout, but that's okay. Cooley Valley, Emre Chan, that's a big there. Bastos. Now, that's 87 rated, so that's not bad. There could still be some good stuff in here. Bastos is not ideal. If you're going to get the 87s, you do want the Emre Chans and the, the Cooley Valleys, but we could still have something nice in here. That's not bad. I tell you what, for a three in form pack, Dost is like 30k. Cahill must, with 69 pace, probably about the same. Yeah, also about 30k. Um, and this Pereira card, it's a position change, which gives it a little bit more value. It's got 90 pace. No, it's 16k. That's, uh, that's, pretty, that's pretty bad. That's pretty brutal. So uh, what have we got? Like 30, 60, 70, about 80,000 coins from this pack. Not ideal. Not the worst. Maybe uh, stop hit markers. Pack luck has uh, turned down a notch since last month. His next team of the week pack. No walkout again. Can we get an Emery Chan this time? Oh, Gamero. Another 87 rated, dudes. Uh, again, we could have Cooley Bally in here. We could have Bastost in here. We could have Emery Chan in here. That Gamero card is very, very nice. Good physicals. Real well-rounded stats. And we've got... Pop -pop. So, Gamero's not bad. I'll tell you what, dudes, for, for the three and four packs, yeah, Gamero's like 70,000. That's nice. He's, he's worth more than the last pack alone. Um, for three and four packs, well, two of the three and four packs, to get an 87 uh, twice, that's, that's really good. Uh, Popov and Gamero will send into the club. Pereira, again, will send up to the tray pile. Not too bad at all. And now, what we are waiting for, the top 100 foot champions pack, we have got available... Messi, 96, 95, Lewandowski, Hazard, Cavani, De Bruyne, Ozil, Dybala, Isco, Robben, Di Maria, Lam, another version of Isco, Benucci, Oblak, Hume, Son, Coutinho, the striker Martial, like Carrasco. There is an immense amount of incredible players. Of course, we are guaranteed a walkout because of the legend. I saw the flag. It's, there's, there's two huge flares for the Reds there. Now, who is the best English legend? Shearer, Ferdinand, be Ferdinand, come on, be Ferdinand, it's Sol Campbell, it's better than Jamie Carragher, it's not as good as Rio Ferdinand, it's not bad, it's a low tier legend, it's Sol Campbell is super super cheap this year in FIFA, but it's a, it's a, uh, is that a usable legend, I would say yes, you could force him into a team, now there were two huge red flares there, so I'm hoping for a couple of the 90 plus rated players, let's see what we've got, come on, be messy EA, be messy, Lewandowski, that's the second time. We got Lewandowski for um, for Epsilon Joey. 95 Lewandowski is huge. Look at this. Lewandowski, huge. Di Maria, huge. Lam, Carrasco, Felipe Luis, and Naby Keita. All of them are huge, huge pulls. Anthony Martial, huge pull. That's, cr that's crazy good, that is. Bastos, a bit mad. Balde, Jao, very nice. DeMarcos. Very, very nice card that is. Maratta is a nice card. Uh, what else we got down here? Not much else down here. I tell you what, dudes. That's a nice set of reds, that is. I would be very, very impressed with that if this were my reds. Of course, they're not. But if they were, that Balde Giao card is, is, is pretty incredible. 4-4, four, 6-foot, four, high-low, 95 pace, 90 dribbling, good shooting and passing. What a card. Um, Jimenez, Dost, Ziek will be good for SBCs. Um, Alves is nice. Jonas and Tovan, good for SBCs. But Keita, fantastic pull. Felipe Luis, fantastic pull. Carrasco, absolutely phenomenal pull, that is. That card is ridiculous. Philippe Lahm, not ideally usable, but an 89 rated Philippe Lahm is great. Di Maria and Lewandowski are huge. Huge. That Di Maria card is deadly. 
you put something that boosts his shooting and physical and you've just got yourself a, an incredible player. And Lewandowski as well, 86 pace, 94 shooting, 93 dribbling, 92 physical, 87 passing, f just phenomenal. We've also got an opportunity for a few more high-rated players, maybe an 88 Son or an 88 Coutinho or an 88 Benteke. We've got that possibility to have those in the remaining cards that we're about to see right now. But Martial was big there as well. What do we have in the final set of players? Son is there. That's unreal. And Alonso and Herrera. That is unreal. In the... In... 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 Epsilon Joey's pack, we had Coutinho, Herrera and Alonso. In this pack, we've got Son, Herrera and Alonso. Brooks is solid. None of the rest of them are. That, yo, I tell you what, that is this Son card, ridiculous. Five-star weak foot, four-star skill moves. Brilliant stats. That is that is a an exceptional dude, an exceptional top 100 pack. That That is worth putting in the effort to be that good at FIFA and grind those games out. That is absolutely worth it. This, though, guys, is going to be the end of the video. If you did enjoy this, be sure to leave a like rating, comment, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. But for now, guys, I'm out. Peace.